Greetings everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here in TNO, the last of Europe, in which right now we are pushing east into, well, not the sphere, but, you know, the all-Russian army revolt, led by a certain not Putin now, which is weird, I don't know what happened. At the end of the last episode, we saw Putin here, and one of you guys said he was 17 at the around 17 years of age at the time of recording. We're also at war with the Grand Principality of Central Siberia, Rurik, as well as the Krasnoyarsk neutral zone. Um, I had to use cons commands to go to war with these guys because we weren't at war with them for some reason. I mean, if you look at the tiles, like 90%, 95%, 97%, and 100% like resistance, so I don't understand that. And I also don't understand why America owns the Caucasus. I literally have no idea. I do have one idea why it's like that, just because... Um, I had another mod installed when I was recording yesterday's video or the last video, and it was a mod I wanted to try on the channel, so that probably forced America to annex the whatever tag it is for the Caucasus, K-A-U, C-A-U, something like that, so I'm not entirely sure why America owns the Caucasus, but they do, so yeah, that, and a lot of you guys pointed that out yesterday, and I, I was like, wait, why does America own this, so... Oh, and Georgia Socialist Republic has a, as a core. Oh, that's kind of cool. But how are we doing over here? Um, I don't really want to fight these guys, I'll be honest. Just because they're, they're so far in. And also, I think we're at war with... Uh, oh, Jason, we just finished Jason's son, too. Oh. Um, so, actually... Oh, we are at war with them. Uh, oh, civilian budget boost. Cool. So, I guess we are at war with Salvin, which kind of sucks. I mean, I, don't get me wrong. I want to unify everybody and everything, but, like... Where are the focus is? So, after this, of course, we have one big old war we'll have to deal with the... Uh, dudes over here as well but oh and also the kazakh national republic too so we'll see what happens it looks like we're pushing pretty darn well into here but i'm just i don't want to fight into here oh, oh supply so bad oh oh okay let's move the lines as fast as possible over here so we can get out of the supply issue zones go 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 and since we're here anyways get the tanks oh god please don't hurt the tanks those are so expensive to make go all the way over here um and let's go ahead and ooh, military intervention uh, hunting opposition, integrate Tomsk would be very nice as well. So, I guess I screwed this up a little bit, but whatever. Um, that's a long time. Military boost just keeps spending. Wow. What are we losing stuff on? Oh, we have 35,000 manpower. Oh, so we cut off most of the, Okay. Nice. We'll cut off most of the divisions, which is pretty nice. I guess Rook didn't make that many divisions this time, which is A-OK -okay with me. Rook is... Rook can be such a massive pain in the tuckus to fight. Like, I hate fighting Rook sometimes. He, 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 sometimes he's got so much strength. Not all the time. I've had some campaigns where he's not that strong, but I've had other campaigns where he's ridiculously strong and I don't ever want to see his face. So. What happened to our manpower? I know we're making a lot of divisions, but. Jesus Christ. What happened to all that manpower? Oh, well, we definitely need. Oh my goodness. I mean, we'll have to do this eventually, so we'll see what happens. Um, getting more political powers nice and all. I wonder if we, we probably won't... Oh! The Crescent region is gone. 3.62, huh? We probably won't get the next level of poverty improved, which is fine, whatever. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Oh, are you guys done? Yeah, just go in. Just just go straight on in. Go, 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 go. Oh, we're out of manpower. That's not good. Um, do that too. Oh, you're done? Oh, you are done. Look at that. Nice. You know what, actually? Give me you. Come over here. We're going to need you for someone else, for another group. Uh, come to Finland. Because Finland might join the Reichspact, maybe. We're going to need soldiers in the north to defend our northern areas. Or I Iran, maybe, or something like that. So, we'll see. <coughs> Sorry, weird uh, sneeze sound. So, actually, for the Reich, or the Ionites Pact, that's so weird that the OFN owns that. So, they're not... So, we have United Arab States. That's actually really cool. But, you have not collapsed yet. Which is good to be aware of. So that's the case. It's only this main front. Uh, that's not bad. Uh, I guess we could throw you back over here for now. But it's alright. And we're still pushing in. How is Salvin doing? Hmm. We've honestly not fought a lot of his uh, divisions yet. Which is fine, but... Early autoloaders. Nice. Free military factories. Uh, oh, we need a lot more support equipment, huh? Oh, we need a lot more of this, too. That sucks. Nice. We need a lot more tanks as well, which makes sense. And get some more research. That'd be good. Just improve our tanks for now. Just improve them. And don't forget about planes. Yeah. Basic jet fighters. Nice. Thank you. We cut this down a little bit more, too. Because we don't have a lot of the resources we need right now. 
Even though we will try to go to war and do the best we possibly can against them, but we'll see what happens. You know, like always. We'll always see what happens. Could use more rubber. I don't mind trading away for it then. That's fine. Thank you. Even though we should build our own sometime. Keep making more civvies? Yes? No? Probably yes? And we're building up a lot of air bases. I gave our guys a lot of things to do, so. Build, build, build. All these resources. Even though it's not a lot of rubber itself, but whatever. It is what it is. Hey, more motor is nice. You guys win in here? Guys, you gotta keep going on in. Oh my gosh, why is there so much resistance here? Bratsk. Go, 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 go. Oh my god. Oh my god, that is so bad. You gotta force the attack. Go in, go in now. Just force your way through if you can. Please keep going. We've only got... Oh my god. Uh... Just go, please, just go, Ulan Uda. Are you guys not trying to get the line, or what? what's going on here? Like, I hate how much resistance there is. It doesn't make sense sometimes. But we are coring stuff, so... Uh, I get that one too, that's fine. You know, I might just do it militarily attacking them, maybe? We'll see what happens, I don't know. Just so slow. Why are... I swear, man, I don't understand sometimes AI. Oh, there's not enough good supply. I guess we'll have to leave then. Fails. Just so much failure sometimes by the AI. Just go in. Wh why? What's there? There's no resistance issues here. Supply? Yeah. We gotta get some logistics next. Yeah. Right, this one. This will save us some fuel too, so. Actually, is that for the next one? Yeah. After that one, we're just gonna go straight for this one too. Just better jet fighters all the time. Because the Germans are going to have a lot of jet fighters and we got to be prepared. Yeah, nice. Yeah, look at that. 1600 is needed. we got plenty of cast, though. And maybe some fighters as well. Which is pretty decent. Um, artillery sh Oh my gosh. Go down by 5. Go down by 5. Oh, it's so bad for anti-tank and guns. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Uh, how much manpower do they actually have? 69,000, nice. Equipment wise, I got plenty of stuff. 44,000 manpower, 43,000 ish. Not bad. Not bad for them. You're going in there. You are not going to lose. I swear to God, you are not going to lose. You son of a rock sucker. You're going to go right here. No, no, no. I said go down there and then go into there. Oh my God. Come on. Why? Why did you let them move? Oh my god. Yeah, you, this Ivan Banov, he sucks. He's garbage. With air superiority, we still... How do we not have air superiority here? What the heck? How? Well, the divisions would get on the line. My goodness, man. Yeah, supply definitely needs a rework. Like, I can't wait for the next DLC to come out. Supply's got to get a rework, man. Move your fat little took us down here. Look how bad these tanks are because of supply. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, we're done. I'm done. Get out of here. We're done. Come to Kazakhstan. Just kill them all this way. I'm sorry, guys. This is ridiculous. <sighs> supply needs a rework, man. I hate fighting land wars in Asia. But seriously. If, unless you lose 40 combat, because these guys are definitely. Our enemies generally use 40 combat as well. Unless you're using 40 combat, you're not going to win. So you're forced to use them. That's the next research done. That's good enough. It's not even manpower issues. It's just god awful supply. I wish AI would prioritize supply more too. That could be very beneficial, but. Uh, last, I do not. Come on. There you go, that's better. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Move those chubby little legs. Some more uh, rubber as well. W w why are you standing still? I mean, I, I don't understand why they stand still sometimes. Because AI is dumb, dumb dummies. I'm just ready to fight the Germans at this point. Yeah, grab that. I almost never use that, so grab it, because you can. Are you going to actually win a battle here? Oh, you can actually win, compared to other divisions. Yeah, these tanks, god-awful. There's no point using them. If they're going to suck this hard. They're just costing us supplies. Plus 400, because the tank commander kind of sucks, man. Go straight down here. Cut them completely off. Do not stop moving. Oh my god. 
I just don't care about supply. Just go. Go, 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 go. You go in there. Alright, we've cut off no divisions. We've got 52,000 of them, which is not bad. Uh, they've got a little more map. They must be mobilizing more or something. How are you losing? I swear to God, man. I Sometimes, like, the AI, like, they just lose on purpose. It does not make any sense. And you, you come over here, and you still have... You have 600 planes in the air. You still can't beat enemy planes. I don't understand that. Okay, what are, what's all these divisions? They're literally going to be 40 combo with. I don't know, they're in, probably elite infantry. Yeah, no, I'm sorry. That's so stupid. That's incredibly stupid. Just, just keep screwing them over. Go, 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 go. Every division you see got, has got to die. All right, 40 combo with sucking hard, sucking very hard right now. Um, grab you guys, grab some of that too, and then we did that group. Should save slightly on fuel, which is not a really concern of mine, but should help with supplies a little bit. Now we're gonna be out of support equipment too, but whatever. Only 25,000 guns, Jesus Christ. Uh, Proof Jet Fighters, though. That's nice. Get some better cast. <laughs> Just straight up pathetic. Just absolutely 100% pathetic. Even when we when we have air superiority, our divisions still cannot win. I just do not understand, man. Just no understanding here. It literally makes no sense. Like we've lost fifty-one thousand. That's insane. Salvin is not this difficult to beat. He really is not. Come on. Oh my god, get your butts in there. How are you losing? How? Yeah, they, sometimes the game is just rigged against you, man. But there's superiority. With doing pl plenty of ground support damage, it's still not enough. It literally makes no sense. Get in there. Cut them off. Just move. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, guys, but... It, it literally makes no sense sometimes. These are parts of TNO that I hate, absolutely hate. Just the, the straight BS. You should five divisions should easily win here, and yet they're just gonna lose. I mean, how stupid is that? Where are you guys at? You're gonna force the attack. I don't care. Force it for them to die. Or if you combine your attacks together, you could probably win here, you dinguses. Starve them out. Starve them out. Kill them all off. I apologize, guys. We lost way too many guys. I mean, this is ridiculous. Salvin is not that difficult. But the AI just... It's so incredibly stupid. It's ridiculously stupid. Extra division... Do we get any attack or defense for our own guys? Doesn't feel like it. Special Forces does, but... We got a little more organization. What is that? State-run fuel? Yeah, we don't get anything. We don't get jack squad in terms of actual ability to kill enemy divisions. That's dumb. But, makes a little bit of sense, but still. Yeah, I'm going to need some time off-screen just to make sure that we we run out of manpower, first of all. But, oh, this has got better armor professional. That also does play a factor, too. Excellent. Professional army, thank God. You're not going to lose. I swear to God, you better not lose here. Oh, I can't force defense. Come on. Please tell me it's over. Oh, thank God. I apologize, guys. That was ridiculously tough. Like, I'm, Salvin's never been that tough. And it's not even air superiority, either. Which literally makes no sense why it was that difficult. I'm ready to just kill off all, all the Germans in the game now. Um, so, I guess we have to militarily invade, which I think is dumb. We should be able to peacefully annex them. Or, no, talk to them, but okay. I just want you to murder every last one of them. I don't care at this point. Like, it... <sighs> the game sometimes sets you up to fail. Like, it really does. It really does. Fighters... Oh, we have no manpower. God dang it. 
There you go. That's fine. Now we've got some manpower. Game. Come on. Nice. Logistics. Uh, one, two. Going right there. Just throw them all right there. Alright, and give him more because you, you don't trust your tanks. I just don't trust them. So these guys have a ton of manpower. We have none. Up to 25 divisions, which is nothing. So we'll see what happens. If the game wants to screw us over again, then so be it. But, you know, I was going to say a lot of good things about TNO, surprisingly. But, you know, the AI, not a big fan of it. Really not a big fan of it. Especially when they. America annexes the caucuses. I mean, just go, why? Hopefully we can core this stuff really fast, because we need that manpower now. The war against... Actually, let's go look here. It's a lot of manpower. That's a crap ton of divisions. Ukraine doesn't have that many. Uh, 3 to 5 is not bad. That's the main group here. Just Mostly just Germany and the Ukraine. Yeah, that's pretty much it. That's not too bad. Tanks? Do I even want tank divisions because of how poorly they performed? Not really, no, honestly. They suck. Even when making them 40 combo with... No, we don't. Oh, we should throw some APCs on here, but still, god awful. Especially after we. I think we finished our land auction. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> we actually lose soft attack. Wow, that sucks. Uh, let's see, we've got some dockyards too. So I do apologize about that, but that's just. There's some really infuriating things in TNO still that I do not like. So yeah, we didn't finish our land auction, but all this other stuff doesn't matter. Organization loss when moving. Doesn't matter. Look look how weak these tanks are. Look how stupidly weak these are because of supply issues. Something I severely don't agree with, especially when we put logistics on. Hmm. Sorry. Can't agree with that. Oh my god. Why is it 75 day focus? Uh, decision. Not a focus, but a decision. That could definitely be changed there. Come on, just go. I want you to just kill them all off, for the love of god. Kill off all the enemies, please. You should easily be able to kill every single one off right here, right now. It's got to be a butcher fest, for, in my opinion, to make up for what we just lost. Oh, also... What are you guys doing here? Here, take a bunch of guys. Um, take that off. Yep. Force it. I don't care. I just do not care at this point. Either win or die. And there's another comment saying uh, liberalism is destroying all the radicals. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, you have an upgrade? Or are you going to suck super hard, Yvonne? You're going to still continue to suck super hard. Do we win? Nice. As we should. Cool. And look at all this. We can integrate. Oh, we can't even integrate that last one. Darn it, that sucks. So, let's get everyone on the line here and prepare for a lot of devastation. And these tanks are going to have to be the group that, uh, well, is going to be needed to uh, fight off any people who want to invade us. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Cool. Wait, what? What? Do we need, is this part of Central Siberia? No, it's not. It is not. Um. Hello? Game? Man, this, this this campaign has kind of been screwed over. Let me go back and I'll go and reunify the motherland. All right, everyone. So my apologies about that. But now, let's go and reunify the re motherland. Democracy in Russia. Democracy in Russia. That's new.
So my apologies about that. I. I I literally couldn't hear anything. Maybe it's still playing, but uh, there's literally nothing there going on. So let's go and get Central Asia. Let's invade the Reich. And we're actually doing pretty well in Pro Project Millennia. So not bad overall. We do a lot of political power. And also, we did get up to secondary schooling already. So not bad, really. Really not bad at all. Alrighty. Uh, this is what I'm talking about, man. Why is the AI so dumb? Why is it? Why is Paradox not trying to fix the AI? Like, man, come on. Bro, just go in. Just a bunch of militia divisions. Yay! That one's done. Awesome, awesome. Take that, that'd be great. Integrate Uzbekistan. Yes, please. Yes, please. Black market trade. Oh, oh, I don't like that. No, thank you. Oh, we need more stability. Why do we have such little stability? Weekly change because we're integrating. Uh, but still, combat rules? Huh. Ashkabat. Nice, nice, nice. Good. good, good. Head into Narn. Little bit of lag. And uh, please keep on moving. Military and states democracy and oh wait, Iberia still exists. Do they not collapse? Whoa! Clean the military. I have I seen this page before? Huh? Maybe I have. Huh? They're still doing content. That's actually really cool. Oh, do you have more millies? Nice. Uh, I'm I'm pretty sure I know how to play this game already. Please, thank you. Um, we still need more tanks here. We could actually use more APCs. We have plenty of guns for now, but that's probably going to be a lie very soon. We actually do need more APCs and get more tanks. And we're going to need more planes anyway, so there you go. And don't tell me we don't have enough to build. Please, for the love of God, don't tell me that. I know for a fact that we definitely, definitely need more to build. We have plenty enough to build here. Um, so is there anything else? Integrate these guys. And negotiate for Vladivostok. If you want to read about that, please go ahead. Negotiations begin. We will invade the Reich very soon as well, as we're integrating a lot of places. And uh, yeah, that'd be good to do as well. Nice. Head on back up top. Let the negotiations begin. If you want to read about that, please go ahead. Yes. Because I've read it through it before, and it's, it's not bad. It's all right. It's important to read, but like I've read it before, and I don't really feel like reading it again. So, also, I did screw up on the air reduction. I don't know why I chose this side. Overwhelming support. We don't have helicopters, so whatever. Um. You know what? Let's save. Let's even get as much as we possibly can. Sounds like a good idea to me. Pushing for as much as we can from the sphere would be a great thing. Would it not be? Wow. With Central Asia, we got so much more manpower. Even though we're demobilizing, which does suck, but it's alright. Halt direct operations, hunting the opposition. There you go. Well, ending repressions. Well, we've done enough. Offer compromise? Yeah, let's let's offer compromise. See what happens. Nice, we don't see that thing anymore. Ooh. Oh, we got some more stuff down here. Nice. Compromise. Um, handing over the asked to maintain research threats in outer Manchuria. Sure, why not? This will look better on the maps anyway, so. Get some more armor. Armor is always nice. So we'll get some better anti-air. And, yeah. Uh, now about a lot of us stuff. Yeah. Euro 375. Might as well, right? Uh, max speed kilometers. 76 kilometers per hour. Not bad. Get some better anti-air, because, my gosh, we're going to need so much air power. Yeah. Acceptable. Air bases, and now I did make sure this time we got plenty of air bases. We got plenty of fighters, even though we have a lot of old garbage, outdated fighters. You guys go over there, do that. Hey, a victory for the motherland! Nice. There's something positive out of this. Cool. And throw 200 more right there, and we're gonna throw as many as much cast on a single army as we possibly can. 800, not so bad. Not too bad. There you go. Do that. Thank you. Duplicate. Boom, boom. And do that group. Now let's put you in half. And actually throw it over there too. Good. Some more tanks. Nice. We could always use more tanks. So do we actually have it? No, we don't. Manchu Quo. Looking a bit too big for uh, for me personally right now. So. A Treaty of Beijing. A victory for the uh, Russian Free Republic. Look at that. Now that's beautiful, my friends. Let's go integrate the areas. areas. Very good. Well, actually, I actually have some manpower now, which is actually very cool. But I do apologize for being a little bit ragey earlier. Just sometimes this mod frustrates me. And I'll be honest, like, I love this mod so much. I, I, I enjoy it so much. Sometimes it does frustrate me, as you can probably tell. But it's time for a little bit of a right, Daddy. A wrong right. And you know what, just in case? Just in case, let's save. Thank you. 779 factors is not enough to take out the Germans, so... Well... Here we go. Let's see what we can do. Oh, our, our, our divisions are... Yeah. Oh, hello. 
Oh, oh, it's hard to see them. Nice. So, how many guys are we fighting? Yay, no turning back now. Final war. Nice. So far, not bad. Like, obviously, like, we pretty much are doing like a blitzkrieg towards them, but at the same time, like, mm, where are the enemy divisions? Liberation of Moscow. Moscow's behind us, which is good. You're going to go off. Oh, offers us. No, no, no. We're going to keep going. Keep going. Germany, where are your divisions? Seriously, look at. Oh my gosh. This is disgusting. Wait. Peace conference. Wait. Oh, the armor of Muscovy. Nah, we're, we're okay. Um, we'll probably now start hitting their divisions, probably, yeah, since we actually touched the Reich. So, yeah, okay. Okay, well, whatever. Oh, oh, we can actually... Oh, yeah. I'm glad we actually had all this extra time to integrate all those guys. Oh, it's so close. Complete German surrender, fate of Vyborg. Oh, yeah, we could probably go to war with them, too, but we need more command... Oh, we have enough command power, huh? Oh, we got in circle. Well, that sucks. What? What? No. Go in. Oh, we actually we got him. Cool. Actually, go in here. Oh, we were so close to encircling them. It's all right. Now we've met the main German army. I don't. I don't where were they earlier? Yeah, both these groups are taking a. We're all taking a lot of losses here. Get some more superiority there, boys and girls. We actually have a challenge here now. Oh my gosh, thousands of men are just dying by the day. It's kind of insane to think about, honestly. Just just throwing men at Schorner's Germany. We technically have more manpower. I'm integrating more guys, so... Technically that's not really fair, but I don't really care at this point. <laughs> win, 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 win. Oh, we actually have too many divisions on the line now. Nice. Go, win, 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 win if you can. Yeah, we're doing... We've lost a lot of guys, but they've lost a third of a million, which is awesome. Area defense is really not going to help us, but I'm going to keep going anyways. I mean, the losses have got to be staggering. Almost half a million already for the enemies. Nice. Obviously, obviously, they're pretty bad for us, too, but still. Ukraine is... They've got to be falling apart. Erkok? Come on. Uh, still have 800,000 manpower, which is pretty good for them, but still. 154,000 losses. They've suffered almost half a million themselves. Overall, not too shabby. Anyone else have upgrades? Gabov? Nah, not really. Not too much. We will stop the attack soon-ish, but I do want to kill off Moscow first, maybe? Or these guys? Yeah, their tanks are not looking good. Their tanks are really bad. Final warning? Wait, the refusal of Tukhachevsky's initial terms of friends delivered his final warning. Dark red flags fly over the border, visible from our forward positions. Beyond the horizon, surely the Bolshevik armies are preparing themselves for the final assault. Uh. What? What? That makes no sense. We've lost a quarter of a million. They've lost three quarters of a million. I just don't think they can keep it up. Obviously, we can't keep it up either, but. Oh! Hey, we've got some tanks, though. Nice. Oh, these guys are surrounded. Oh, that's so bad for them. But I don't care. They're not us. And we're not them. <coughs> Make sure they can't link up. Oh, these guys are linked. Oh, now they linked up. God dang it. That sucks. Hey, but get, killing all these guys off is extremely good. Extraordinarily good. Nice. Take one guy here. Awesome, awesome. Start a nuclear war? I mean, I'd rather not. I'd rather not start a nuclear war just yet. Uh, would you guys like to go in? Look at all those divisions. Bye-bye. They lost over a million men so far. And we almost have probably roughly the same number of divisions as they do. Still plenty of manpower. We got plenty of manpower as well, though. 
And they're out of some planes. Yes. Yeah, so, uh, some tanks. They've got plenty of anti-tank. Got a good amount of, you know, artillery. And they're looking really bad in some of these areas. I mean, we're not looking good either. Don't get me wrong. But, overall, it's not too bad. The war with Soblin was more difficult than this. I don't understand sometimes, man. I really don't. How's air looking? Belarus is still... Jesus Christ. Just so much death in the air right now. Nice. Ukraine, looking god-awful as well. Oh my goodness. Well, we're moving through Auslan, which is pretty good. Um, why can't we get any more political power yet? Okay, move Russian capital? Might as well. Uh, now that the Russian people have finally triumphed over Germany, it's the time to decide what the future capital of Russia will be. Much of the government has supported the move to return to the capital of Russia back to Moscow, but there are a good deal of people who believe they should keep the capital here in the Russian, Russian Free Republic. The Third Rome. Nice. Where are you guys at? You're still fighting in the center, huh? Um, it's just a grind fest right now. 1.71 million. We've lost almost 400,000. And this doesn't include all of, like, the Ukrainian soldiers, Belarusian soldiers, so... Hey, man. They're making their own decisions. We're making our own decisions. Multi-combat rule. That'd be kind of cool. Uh, engineering? Did I do... That was 1980. Cool. Get some more fuel. We could probably use... Eh, actually, maybe we don't need any more fuel. Oh. We need, could use some more rubber, though. Oh, and we've all lost Nice. Yeah, we're just grinding out their strength right now. My goodness. My goodness. Yep, they've taken over 2 million casualties, which is awesome, awesome, awesome. Shauna, you gotta give it up. You're almost out of manpower. What's the other one? Oh, it does. Hey, we're on the last development stage. Didn't I start a nuclear war? Uh, as much as I think that'd be fun, I think for now, probably not. Oh, uh, we've taken Königsberg, which is awesome. We've overran some more divisions. Their armies are slowly falling to us. Oh, yes. Oh, look at all the overrun. I mean, obviously, we're not winning a lot here. But at the same time, neither are they, so... Some really thick bodies we got here. And we like them thick. Oh, wait, what? We can do that. My question is, when are they going to start suing for peace? There goes Slovak State. Um, I'm not sure when they're going to sue for peace. I hope they sue for peace soon. I don't want to actually, you know, have a nuclear war here. I just, I just wanted my territories, which we've won, but oh, ultimate demand. It's best not to tempt. Surely they're bluffing. I'd love to just kill them off right now. How many days do we have for this? Oh, one day. Okay, so it's probably best not to tempt fate. I mean, we did really well. We've cut off over 3 million Germans. We've destroyed the German army. Absolutely massacred it. Might as well do that. So, wait, what? Do we not get... The world is safe. Cool. We've prevented a full-on nuclear war from occurring, saving billions upon billions of lives and keeping the world today surviving for now. Who knew threatening people with nukes would get them to stop? So, when do we get... No, it's going to belong to us. Oh, wait. that's so stupid. I can't... Yeah, I, that's something I don't like in this the second Rush, Warlord Russian mod. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, you guys come all here. Why do we have these guys? What? There's some things I really just do not understand here. Like, it makes literally no sense. Why do, why do they exist again? Why do we have to do with this? Um, here. You're pretty good at attacking defense. There you go. Uh, we have peace treaty until when? Uh, 20th? Oh, that's so dumb. Uh, yeah, that's not very cool. So, um, 
Yeah. Well, I guess we're going back to the war of Ukraine. This is stupid. I don't like this whole border war thing. Yeah, no. I'm sorry. You should have an option for border war or just go straight in. I think that'd be a better deal overall. Yeah, I'm going back to war with these guys. Screw that. We're not going to tolerate no for an answer like this. No way. No, it just... This micromanagement at the end of campaigns, I hate, hate, hate so much with a passion. I mean, I, I, I don't understand why they didn't just give us the territory we wanted. So, I guess it's round two, everybody. The real destruction of the German front this time. Because they didn't capitulate us last time. So... I guess I could be doing this more cleanly, but at the same time, I don't really care. I mean, we, we've won, so... Whatever. Apologize for the clicking, too. We've already integrated, like, Moscow as well, which wouldn't make any sense, realistically, because it's been so heavily Germanized and de russified and slightly russified, but... Hey, we got Kiev. I'd love to do that, but one last chance. Complete... Yeah, we didn't get this one at all. Haves deny. Oh, it's because we don't have the Caucasus piece, though. That makes sense. I don't like that. Yeah, the Caucasus really screwed us over, didn't it? It really did. Man, the Germans are just here to suffer. Like, you almost feel bad for them. Almost. Almost. Go, 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 go. So how many have we killed off already? 5,000? Wow. Yeah, they're out of soldiers. They're completely out. Nice. So, okay, well, I mean, Germany wanted it twice. This is your nation on liberalism. Just destroying Nazis left and right. God, where's their man? I want to kill more Nazis. Let's go. It's all right, though. So, hopefully we get another peace deal, because we eat them up. So, yeah. Now, what happens if we capitulate them twice? Do they just pizza you out with you? Can we can we just, like, stroll into Germania? I think that'd be a lot of fun. Go on, boys. Go on, go on, go on. Never fast enough, but that's all right. And go to Frankfurt, Hamburg, München. Even though you're not going to make it there in time, but... And Germania's will be ours. Yay! Well, Germania's not nice this time of year, because it's already probably all blown up, but whatever. Oh, where is uh, Denmark? Amsterdam? So if we take them out again, what happens? Because my goodness, are we flooding them? There goes Slovak State again. Ordnungsvolgesam? Are they not gonna... Can we actually eat them? One of the most bizarre times we've actually taken out Germany. Because this is a little bug right now. Uh... Well, we're definitely racing for this area. Oh, we actually have a peace conference deal. Look at that. Sort of. I've never done this in TNO before. Um. Yeah, we'd probably want to integrate those guys. Yeah, this is very weird. Who are we still at war with? Britannian, Scandinavian. So, I guess we can't eat them, but... Oh, it's lagging. Oh, God, it's lagging. Oh! They actually nuked us. Nuked us. Oh, well, okay. We didn't get the conference. Well, everybody, uh... Well, the game crashed. The mod crashed. And as you can see, it's, it's a little bug right now. But, hey, I guess that's going to be it. And we actually ate up all of Germany. But, uh... Well, I guess not everyone's dead yet. But, hey... If you enjoyed my rage, leave a like. If you didn't enjoy my rage, leave a like. Um, if you enjoyed the campaign, leave a like, I guess. Whatever. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I guess I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great, great Russian free republic rest of your day.